Hi, everybody. This is Pastor Tom Fricke, and I'm here to uh, give you a few notes about Sunday School Catechism classes and Bible studies as we move forward uh, under the quarantine. Uh, Sunday School materials have been sent out to the students who have been attending Sunday School. Northwestern Publishing House has done kind of a neat thing during this time. They've uh, granted free access to christ light lessons and materials for parents to be able to use at home. And parents can just access those materials through the Northwestern Publishing House website or the link that has been sent out to them via email. If anybody has any questions about that, you can just contact either Marcy Went or myself or one of the teachers, and they can maybe help you through uh, using those materials. Secondly, with regard to catechism classes and Confirmation Day, as you know, Confirmation Day was scheduled for Sunday, April 26th, and our confirmation exams, our profession of faith service, and confirmation services have all been canceled, or at least it looks extremely unlikely that we're going to be able to hold any of those events at the regularly scheduled times. All of this is a little bit uncertain right now as to when we're going to be able to have those uh, services and events in the future uh, could be May, could be late May, it could even be into June, and uh, it, it's just a matter of wait and see at this time. Uh, it does seem as though when we do get closer to the day when uh, the restrictions are starting to be lifted, uh, we're going to make some plans, we'll call you up, and uh, we may have to just move rather quickly to be able to schedule a confirmation day that's going to be different from any confirmation day we've had in recent memory. Meanwhile, students though are working on their profession of faith uh, essays that they would be presenting to the congregation. Uh, parents are going through the review questions with students at home and all of this is taking place uh, via Google Docs and email and it seems to be working okay for the time being. As far as Bible studies are concerned, our Bible studies in person have been suspended, but there are Bible study helps that are available. You can watch your flock notes on Mondays. Uh, Pastor Janish is sending out a sermon quote. On Tuesdays, the SOAP Bible reading plan. If you don't know what that is, check it out when it comes out on Tuesdays. Wednesday, there is the worship service on video, and Thursday, there is a video devotion that Pastor Janish is doing. On Friday, something new, uh, we're going to be doing a Philippians Bible study based on something I've done with a small group here, and uh, you'll be able to go through the book of Philippians with us, and this is going to be an ongoing kind of Bible study that we'll be doing for quite some time to come, and there will be a Bible study on one side of a sheet of paper and answers on the other side, and then finally, on Saturdays, uh, we'll be sending out through Flocknote uh, Theological Rambling, something brand new where there is a kind of an interview on a topic uh, that comes from our catechism, a doctrinal topic. Uh, our church website has also got a lot of resources for you to follow. Uh, worship services on DVDs and sermon copies are available here at church, and the library remains open. But if you'd like to get on our church website, there are other uh, resources that you can click on there. Worship services, Wells Daily Devotions, the Bread for Beggars website, if you don't know what that is, I I'd invite you to click on that link on the Trinity uh, website. And the Holy Hen House is uh, uh, a website uh, by women for women, and it's uh, extremely well done. Also, the Time of Grace videos and devotions are available also with a click click on our church website, trinitybrilliant.org. Um, finally, one last thing that I'd like to mention, you can always send us a text or, or give us a phone call. Uh, any of the pastors here would tell you that the best phone call we ever receive is the one that begins, uh, Pastor, I was reading my Bible and I'm stumped. I've got a question. We love to answer questions like that. It's what we live for. And uh, you don't feel that you're imposing on us if you happen to just give us a call and say, hey, Pastor, I just wanted to talk to you about something here. So that's what I have for this time. And I uh, thank you for your time. Stay safe and God's blessings to you and your family.